has had a couple of games now where he's he's been more aggressive and it's been working out. Um, and, 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 did you have any conversations with him to sort of like help him out of? Oh, sorry, I know you don't. <laughs> um, what, what have you seen from from him in terms of how he's flipped that switch? Um, I think so. Um, I think he just you know sometimes he doesn't realize how great he is and how you know the the, the things that he possesses out on the floor. And um, when he, when he, when Zoe realized how good he is on the floor, um, it makes him a very dynamic player, and it makes us even better. And uh, and he's and he's been doing that as of late. You know his his aggressiveness, um, even when he's not making, just his attack. If you seen early in the game, just him getting to the rim, and he missed a couple of them. You know that's absolutely fine. He had a couple charges. That's absolutely fine. We, you know, when he's aggressive, it just changes our dynamic of the team. And um, you know. He's been doing that as late, and we need him to continue to do that because he's, uh, he's very good. When you say that he doesn't know how great he is sometimes, do you think that that has, comes with just how naturally No, he it's, just, it's going to come with it. It's going gonna, it's gonna to happen. I mean, I think um, we, we, he's, he's not even a, he's a year and how many games? Does he even have 82 under his belt yet? I don't think so, right? He doesn't have 82 games under his belt yet. So um, I think uh, every game is another teaching, uh, you know, a teaching point for him. And the experience will... You know, continue to happen more and more, and he's going to know where he, what he does um, extremely well to help us, but more importantly, help him be successful on the floor. So, you know, um, I, I, I can see it, um, but sometimes, you know, you know, for you personally, you have to continue to figure it out. But you know, he's like I said, he hasn't even put a full regular season into his uh, to his books yet. Remember how long it took you to kind of find that balance between the scorer and facilitator? Yeah, it took me uh, probably after my sophomore year of high school. <laughs> yeah. I know you guys want to stack wins no matter how you can do it, but you know the number you look for is like 30 assists means it's a good game in terms of Sherman. You only had 10 tonight. No, it horrible, horrible, um, horrible, man. Um, you look at the you know the stats, but you know uh, offensively we just found a way late in the game, but we was just defending. The best thing about it when we you know we was turning the ball over, but. We, we still held them in the, in the half court. We, we did a, a number on them in the half court defensively, but we're not going to win many games like that when we turn the ball over 24 times, only have 10 assists. But at the end of the day, when you're not playing well offensively, you still can't let that uh, deter you from getting stops. And uh, that's, that's a that's signs of a, of a team that's growing. You know, um, even with a young team for us to, you know, sometimes you can get, um, you know, sidetracked when you're not doing things great offensively. You start to let your defense, uh, you know, hurt you. So. And that didn't happen tonight, so you know, it's good. It's good. It's a good uh, step in the right direction for a ball club. Luke was saying that um, sometimes on the transition offense, the guy who was pushing the ball up the floor was kind of all alone, didn't have the rest of the team coming up. But do you guys feel like you need to recommit to that a little bit? Uh, yeah, we want you know the first, first, you know, first of all, the first game after a road trip is always tough, um, and even more so the first game after Thanksgiving is even tougher. Um, you know, so you add that all into it, but. You know, we need to clean up some of our passes. We gave up a, a, a lot of buckets that we had, you know, on two-on-ones or three-on-twos in our fast break, but we just didn't make the, the proper pass. So uh, we, we'll get better with that. LeBron, you guys started two and five. You've now won nine of your last 11. What's the biggest difference between the two and five team and, and the team that's won nine and 11? Um, every game is an opportunity for us to get better. It's a teaching point for us, um, and, and we're learning. Like I said, this is a process for our ball club. Um, you know, everybody uh, loves instant oatmeal, but um, you know, gr greatness is not um, it's not appreciated that way. And you have to just work your habits. You have to get better and better throughout every month. And uh, so far, we've done that this season. Appreciate it. Thanks, Thanks so much. Thank you.